In this video, I am going to show how to download and install PyCharm on Windows operating system. So let's get started. At first, open your favorite web browser and browse this URL jetbrains.com and then click on developer tools then select PyCharm click here and then click on the download button now select the operating system click on the windows and then select the edition that you want to download there are two edition of PyCharm professional and community I am going to download the PyCharm community edition. It is free and built on open source. Now click on this download link to download PyCharm. I already have downloaded it. So after a successful download, go into downloads folder and open this installer. If you asked a question from user account control, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device, select yes option. The setup will guide you through the installation of PyCharm Community Edition. It is recommended that you close all other applications before starting setup. Click on next to continue. Now choose the installation location. This is the default installation destination folder. If you want to change this folder, click on the browse and select another folder where you want to install PyCharm and then click on next. I am going to install it on this destination folder. If you want to create a shortcut icon, check this box and also if you want to add the path environment variable, check this box and then click on the next. Select the start menu folder in which you would like to create the program's shortcuts. Click on install. It may take a while for installing PyCharm Community Edition, so be patient. That's it. Installation completed. Your computer must be restarted in order to complete the installation of PyCharm Community Edition. If you want to restart right now, check this box otherwise check this box then click on finish now i am going to open pycharm community edition read the user agreement carefully and then check this box to accept the terms of the user agreement then click on continue Now do some customization. Increase the font size. Okay, now I am going to create a new project. Make sure that you already have installed Python on your system to work with PyCharm community. If you don't have installed, Python on your system. I am going to show you how to download and install Python. Browse this URL, then download Python for Windows operating system. It may take a while for downloading Python. After successful download, go into 
downloads folder and open this installer now check this box also check this box and then select the customize installation option then click on next check this box finally click on install button if you asked a question from user account control do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device select yes it may take a while for installing python that's it python install successfully close this setup wizard and close pycharm community and then reopen I'm going to write the project name my first project and then check this box if you want to create git repository otherwise uncheck and then if you want to create a welcome script check this box otherwise uncheck okay and then choose the interpreter type if you want to create custom environment then check this box to generate a new virtual environment and select the type from this drop down list or you can select existing virtual environment select this option now select the location where you want to store the newly created virtual environment i am going to store it on this location okay now click on create now i am going to create a simple script so open a new file I am going to name it main okay I am going to write a simple Python script that will print a message run this script from terminal write this command Python main hit enter that's it you can run this script from graphical user interface simply click on this run button that's it if you like this video like comment and share thank you so much for watching this video